Hi, today in this video I will show you how to install Epson L220 printer on your computer. There are two options to install this printer. First is using its full feature driver and the second is using its basic INF driver which you will have to install it manually. So let's start with the full feature driver. First of all, download these drivers, both of the drivers from the internet. You can download from the official website or you can download from the uh, below given video description, download link. This is a basic driver. So I will tell you how to install this manually later. So start with the full feature driver. Just double click on it after download. Click on yes. It will start installing. Just click on OK. Click on OK. Select the agree option and click on OK again. Now it is asking to connect the printer to your computer and make sure the printer is turned on. Okay. When you connect the printer, it will be gone. Auto detect the printer cable, printer connection, and it will be gone. In the same way, you can install the scanner driver, double click on it, click on yes, click on next. I agree and click on next again. It is installed successfully. We'll click on finish. So this was the full feature driver installation. Your printer Epson L220 must be installed after this process. If anyhow this print this installation doesn't work for you, the full feature driver doesn't work for you, then you can go with the basic drivers. If this driver works, then don't you don't need to go to the basic drivers right so let's see how to download and install the basic driver on your computer let's start with the downloading the drivers first this is the driver uh, this driver is not available on the Epson's official website this driver is a download link is given in the video description. You can download it from there. Okay. So download the driver and unzip it. Right click on it and click on extract to this folder. Here you go. In this folder you have two options, the 32-bit and 64-bit. If your computer is 32-bit, you can go with the 32-bit, otherwise go with the 64-bit. I have 64-bit. In 64-bit you will get printer driver and the scanner driver. Printer driver, there is no option to install it manually, uh, sorry, automatically. You will have to install it manually with this file. Okay. I will show you how to install with this file, this INF file. This one. This is an 
INF file. So uh, close it. Let's see how to install it manually. Just click on start button and go to your settings and then go to the devices then go to the printer and scanners and click on add a scanner a printer or scanner this method will work with uh, windows 7 windows 8 windows 10 windows 11 all the operating system of windows X vista Uh, click on the printer that I want uh, is not listed. Click on it. And select the last option. Add a local printer or network printer with the manual settings. Click on next. Uh, this is an important step. So please uh, check it carefully. Here you need to select the port where your printer is connected right now. So uh, click on the drop down menu. And select the port USB 001 or 002 where your printer is connected. It depends on where your printer is connected. I select the 001 and click on next. If uh, this option comes only if your printer is connected, right? So make sure your printer is connected and your printer is turned on. If your printer is not connected, then these options are not listed here. Understand? And click on USB 001 and click on next. After that, click on have disk and go to the same folder where we have extracted the files, the driver files. Browse, go to the desktop and this one. Now go to your system type 64 bit printer drivers and this one select this file and click on open click on ok here is the driver just select the driver and click on next click on next again and the driver is installing so please wait for a while Click on next again. Click on finish. And the printer is installed manually. You can see here. Right? So, in this video, you have learned how to install Epson L220 printer manually and automatically. Hope you have liked this video. If you like, please subscribe our YouTube channel. That's all I requested from you guys in the image of this video. Alright guys, that's it for now. See you in the tech, new tech videos. Bye-bye.